beautiful souls welcome back to my channel so today's video is extra special and i'm going to be sharing my favorite luxury high-end uh beauty favorites these are the products that i've been using for about a couple of years now and also it's going to be like this is something that i really like doing and i've not done a full face of luxury makeup since a really long time so yes this video is going to be like my favorite makeup and I can't wait to show you guys which are my favorite products. So these products are the ones which like I mentioned, I have collected them over the years and they've been my personal favorites that I've actually repurchased them over the time. Also during that time, I found new favorites for me as well. So I'm going to be showing you guys those as well. First up, we have the Valentino's V Lighter. This is in the shade Rosa. And this is like a perfect, you know, like I would say like a stroke cream. So this particular primer is like a dual use uh, liquid face base, like a face primer. I would say like a stroke cream and also a top coat. So it's like an all-in-one illuminator. The primer not only preps my skin, but also gives me a very nice rosy glow. It's perfect for that lit from within kind of look. Next, I'm reaching out for the Gucci Beauty's Natural finish foundation i'm in the shade 260 warm i actually love this foundation more because it is a natural finish foundation i prefer natural finish foundations over matte foundations because i somewhat believe that matte foundations tend to dry my skin so i really like using these the foundation even more because it gives me impeccable coverage with of course feeling very light airy and luxurious onto my skin Next up for my concealer, I really, really love the Dior's Forever Skin Correct Concealer. You can see I've used it quite a bit up till now. So I really like that this concealer is a very nice natural finish concealer. But except for that, even though it's a very super creamy concealer, it doesn't crease under my eyes at all. So I, I use it for long wear makeup looks as well. I'm going to softly blend this out with this brush. Now this is since this is a really soft natural makeup look that I'm trying to achieve. I really want my makeup to be, you know, very soft and not too, um, I would say like not too makeup -y, which looks like a makeup, but uh, to be really, really soft and blend it out like, you know, like a feather airbrushed kind of soft look. Now for setting my face, I'm going ahead with the Dior Forever's uh, Cushion Powder and this is in the shade Medium. So this is a really cute cushion powder from the brand and I always, always end up spilling the powder when I open this. So be if you guys have this, be really careful when you open this. Now this powder gives me a really soft focus effect onto my skin. It perfectly blurs out all the imperfections giving my face a really airbrushed makeup look. I really like to dab this powder, especially around my T-zone because that is the part where I tend to be oily or I would say. Now I'm adding a little slush of color with the Hermes blush. I absolutely love the packaging of this blush. I also like the color of this blush because it gives me a really fresh and a very perfect flush of color on my cheeks. And honestly speaking, the packaging of this blush is to die for. It comes with this really nice or mess cute logo and here's the blush inside. Now to add a really ethereal rosy glow i'm going ahead with the dior's backstage palette and i've selected the shade rose gold this is from the rose gold palette absolutely love the dior's backstage highlight palette the palette is so versatile to use now for the sun kissed glow i'm going ahead with the gucci beauty's bronzer and this bronzer is super pigmented i must say so use it 
very very carefully i'm blending this out with a bigger fluffier brush absolutely love how buildable this contour is now for my eyeshadow i'm using the dior's rouge shafalga eyeshadow palette i really like this eyeshadow palette it has like different shades and i can customize it as i really like the way that this eyeshadow palette has different shades and actually honestly speaking the red shade is my favorite out of it so i'm going to create a soft smoky eye at the inner corner i'm going ahead with the white shimmery shade from this palette for my mascara i'm going to use the charlotte tilbury's pillow talk mascara This lipstick is a really nice satin matte texture. I absolutely love this color, but the only downside of this lipstick is that it's not transfer proof, but I am obsessed with this lipstick only for one reason, that is the snake print on the lipstick bullet, and I absolutely love 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 this lipstick. And there you have it guys a full face is my favorite luxury makeup products if you guys enjoyed this video do not forget to watch these two videos as well and all the links are mentioned down in the description below so if you guys want to have a look then you can do that and i will see you guys in another video